Friends, today let us see one of a small story from Mahabharata epic. Pandavas were defeated by Kauravas in a dice game and they were sent to forest for 13 years exile which is consisting of 12 plus 1. 12 is normal exile and 1 year is Agnata Vasa which means if anyone identifies they are the Pandavas they have to continue the 12 years pattern again and again. End of the 12 years exile in the forest and they were at the beginning of Agnata Vasa. While they were in the forest, Yudhishthira became tired and thirsty. So his younger brother Nakula set out to fetch water and found a beautiful lake. The lake was empty with no creature except for a crane. When he attempted to take water from the lake, the crane spoke, "O oh Nakula, the water of this lake will turn into poison if you take without satisfying my answers." Nakula ignored the crane and drank the poisonous water and died. He was running on but no sight of Nakula. His twin brother Sahadeva came in search of his brother and found the same lake and saw Nakula died. and was won by the crane but sahadeva too ignored the crane and he was also thirsty and he drank the water and he also died one after the other arjuna and bhima met the same fate and died by drinking the water none of his brothers returned with water yudhishthira followed the trail and found the lake and all lying dead before searching his brother skiller he decided to drink some water because he was so thirsty but when the crane warned him he realized that the crane had an answer for his cause of his brother he agreed to answer the question of the crane and the crane became the crane revealed itself as a yaksha according to the mahabharata epic yaksha asked approximately 125 questions to yudhishthira but i will tell you some of the interesting questions and which are needed in our life yaksha asks who makes the sun rise and yudhishthira answers the brahma the supreme and next question he asks what is heavier than earth and he answers mother yaksha asks the justification for his answer mother and yudhishthira says that earth is compared to as mother no other than mother is more lovable than anyone then yaksha became happy asks next question what is higher than heaven and he answers father father is one of the biggest pillar in the family who supports all the person he asks what is faster than wind and he says to this question mind mind is faster than the wind because if i think i think a place or an object i will travel to that particular place within a second more faster than a wind and then next question he asks who is guest of all creatures and he says agni agni is the first creation in the evolution and it will be in every part of the creation and what is best of all gains he says and according to this question he answers health health is all gains because without health we cannot live yudhishthira had answered all question one by one and satisfies yaksha alone yudhishthira had answered all questions in a satisfactory manner but the yaksha only allowed him to choose one of his brothers to be restored to life yudhishthira chose the younger half brother nakula the son of his step mother madri reasoning that i am son of kunti had a living son regardless but step mother madri did not the yaksha was impressed by how yudhishthira followed dharma in every little thing he did yaksha revealed himself to be yama dharma the god of death who was also for yudhishthira's father he revealed to that he revealed that he has disguised himself as a crane he blessed yudhishthira telling him that since he had the dharma would protect the pandavas and no one would recognize them during the agnatavasa 
all of the pandavas were restored to life at the end of the story